Hello my night owls and welcome back to another sim video. We are in create a sim because I am creating me. I am creating myself. I thought about a few things I wanted to do in the sims and I wanted to create myself which I already done that but I don't think I made a video of me making myself. So I decided why not make a video of me making myself and I've also made my cat Rin. Now the reason why I'm making my myself and my cat is because I thought about maybe making a video about my life making like playing out my life in the sim. I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing yet but that's kind of the idea I'm going for. I don't know how exciting the video is going to be or anything like that but yeah. So I created myself and I, while I was making her, I had a hard time making myself because like I sat and I stared at a picture while I was making it and I'm like, okay, this kind of looks like myself but I'm not really positive. You guys tell me what, what you guys think. I have a picture on the screen so look at this picture on the screen and look at the sim and tell me if I did myself justice or not. But yeah, so I created myself. I do not wear any makeup, but you see me put eyelashes on her and lipstick on. But like the lipstick is like nude lipstick because I like the nude lipstick because it's like kind of the same color as the skin. So that's why I put the lipstick on her. But I don't wear makeup. Um, it's because it takes so much time to like put the makeup on. So it's like. Why do I want to put, like, do makeup on myself? I only do it on certain occasions, which is when I go out to dinner or something like that. But yeah, so I put lashes on her, but the lashes I have on her wouldn't work with glasses, so I had to put on the other lashes that had, like, the mascara. So that's why I'm telling you guys this. So right now she has, like, regular eyelashes on, but eventually when I put on the glasses, they do not work with the glasses, which sucks, so I had to go with a different- I wanted my girl to have lashes, so I had to go with one with- had the eyeliner and, uh, and they would work with the glasses. The glasses aren't the correct glasses, the ones I have uh, on my face right now, but they were the closest that I could get and they look good on my girl. I had a hard time dressing my girl because like some of the outfits that they had I wouldn't really wear in real life so I tried my best to dress her in a way that I would dress in real life and I think she came out really good and I really really like how she came out. I hope you guys did too. I had a really hard time with Rin. I got to Rin and I started to make him and it it was really hard to make him and he looks nothing like my cat in real life. But I tried my best and I think he came out really cute too. Eventually I'm going to do a video on me creating my apartment. So it's not a place, it's not a house, it's an apartment. But it's, it's like I cut out my apartment, put my apartment just on a lot. And then in that video I will explain it when that video comes out. But yeah, so I'm going to be making another video of me making my apartment, which I've already done that video where I created my apartment and I posted it up this video I'm going to be planning out. I needed to recreate my apartment, so I did that. I recreated my whole entire apartment again and you guys are going to see it. I was going to put it in this video, but if I did that, it would have been really, really long. So I did the create a sim, create myself and my cat in this video and in the next video, I will be creating my apartment as well as playing. So it'll be, the, in the beginning, it'll be speed build and then it'll be me playing as myself. Yeah, so I'm going to have another video coming out explaining everything and recreating my apartment and I'll talk over that and tell you guys more about the apartment and how things are different and so on and so forth. But that'll be in that video. So yeah, we're creating my sim and then I was also thinking of putting in people that is in my life. Like my best friend, my mom, and other people that are like very close to me. Creating them and putting them in with me so um, it's more like my life and stuff like that. Also, 
I have a walk-in disability. Now, in The Sims, you cannot give a sim a physical ability, like a walk-in disability or being in a wheelchair or anything like that. But my girl is, is taking it after me, so we're gonna say she has a walk-in disability, even though she technically does not have one. And I wear a brace on my right leg, and of course I could not get a, the brace and put it on her right leg like I have one on mine. So yeah, we can't really give her a disability and put a brace on her and make her just like me. Which kind of sucks. I'm hoping maybe in the near future the Sims creators will give Sims disabilities so you can give her maybe a walking disability or you put her in a wheelchair or something like that. That would be like super cool and awesome. But we'll have to wait and see for the future for that. She can't have a physical walking disability like I do. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So starting off with my sim girl and my cat. And then eventually I will add in other people that are very important to me. Also stick around until the very end and you will see some pictures of my girl and pictures of my kitty cat at the very end of the video. And yeah, that's pretty much it my night owls. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, give this video a thumbs up and I'll see all you beautiful night owls in the next video. Goodbye. Will you follow me when the sky starts to change? Yeah, we won't be afraid. We'll never be the same.